Yo, welcome once again to My United HQ, fellow Red Devils and football fans across the world. We did it. My United 4, Newcastle 1. So, as was promised earlier by our manager, the boys have responded really well after that 6 1 humbling defeat to Spurs. The presented lineup was a bit questionable, in my opinion, especially with the omission of Mason Greenwood. But according to Ole, Greenwood was not feeling fine, so they had to leave him out and stick with Daniel James. Yeah. Hope he recovers soon before the game against PAG. So if you watch the game, you could realize United started the game poorly, no real cohesion. But I think we stepped up a couple of minutes after Newcastle's first goal. Maguire found a clever way to get his lost confidence back, thanks to Ole having faith in his keeper. This goal will indeed aid his mental faculty to at least for now make the headlines for the good reasons. So for the first time in his senior career, Bruno Fernandes missed from the sports. Fernandes missed a penalty, as relentless as he is, he managed a delightful chip to the top right corner to push United ahead. Fellow Manchester United fans, Juan Bissaka scored a goal, and we need to be happy for him. We know him to be good at the back, but we often don't trust his attacking prowess, but this time round he gave us a glimpse of what he could do. That goal is a typical number 9 goal and he has every right to be happy. This is how he reacted. Can't explain the feeling. 50 games banked, first frame goal. We thank God. Hashtag AWB with that spider web icon. Yeah, so this was his reaction after that superb goal. We all hope he can do more going forward in the coming games. So. We can all attest to the fact that um, the introduction of Van de Beek and Pogba changed the complexion of the game. Van de Beek had an instant impact in the game after coming on for Daniel James. So he didn't score, but his passes and ball recoveries were on point. He hardly made any mistake. Ole will have to consider getting him to play consistently in the upcoming games. We all felt his quality when he came on the pitch. We can't simply ignore this fact. He gets a formation that will accommodate the Dutchman. Of course, Rashford was very, very instrumental in our win with his double assist and his last minute goal. So, apart from the scorers, Mata and David De Gea were equally immense. That save from David De Gea cannot be overlooked. That was De Gea on his day. It will be beneficial if he gets this form back in subsequent games. We miss this David De Gea so much. So, yeah, let me know your thoughts on this match, your man of the match in the comment section. Subscribe if you're a Manchester United fan and don't forget to leave a like on the video as well. Thanks for watching.